Hello, this is Winter Kiwi, and welcome back to my Let's Play Planet Coaster. In the last video, we um, basically built the front end of the entrance and uh, started working on the entrance plaza outside of the theme park. Today, I am going to finish off putting the garden around the edge, um, and then basically, yeah, start working on the first ride, which I plan on putting a carousel in. Um, right now I'm just basically putting path around the edge just so it's, it's basically easier to make a pond that way so you can control where your train is and stuff so as you can see I'm putting this path around the outside and then I'm going to put a hole in the middle just to just so control like I said control is where you terraform that's the word I was thinking before I want it to look like a kind of overgrown sort of factory courtyard for the whole entrance of the theme park. So we'll see what that looks like in a bit when I finished, obviously. Okay, so I'm going to lower down the, the stuff now, the um, grass. Uh, I don't like that. Or do I? No, it's too, too deep. I need it to be less um, intense. That's right, intensity. Okay, something. Yeah, that's more like it. So just like a, uh, just as like a small dip, like a trench sort of thing. There we go. Now I need to fill it up with water. Make sure that doesn't go underneath there as well. I can't put the water in for some reason. Um, why can I not put the water in? Uh, why can I not put the water in? Hello? Maybe it's just because it's like going underneath a bit. Now let's try it. I still can't put the water in. Why can't I put the water in? Um, maybe, um, I don't know. Maybe the path needs to be a bit more, like the trench needs to be wider. I make the path somewhere else, like make it a bit wider. Make it two squares along instead of one. Something like that. All the way around, obviously. I can't place it there for some reason. I think it might be just because uh, the path goes wider. Oh well, let's keep placing. You shouldn't be able to terraform through that bit then. Okay, now it's to the, this path. Okay, now let's see if I can make this wider and then put water in. I can't put water in, so let's make it wider. I don't want it too deep either. It's literally just supposed to be like it's all overgrown. It's kind of like flooded. Like a swamp sort of land and it's taken over the factory. Okay, now let's try and put the water in. I still can't. Oh wait, there we are. Mm, I just can't make it too deep. Okay, that's fair enough. I could put the rocks sort of going around the outside. Maybe just give it a bit more detail and stuff. I just realised I made a bridge over there in the corner. Where I am now. It's not maybe a bridge. <laughs> oh well. 
Now put the water in. Again, I can't do it too deep. And it hasn't filled it all up. Why hasn't it filled all up? Slow it down a bit, I guess. That's more like it. Perfect. Well, not perfect, but it looks nicer when the garden is completely done. Now I just need to remove the path, remove the bridge. Uh, my cards are here. There we go. Come on, delete. Ah. Uh, okay. I shall time lapse the um, basically me putting all the foliage down, and I'll be back in a bit. Bye bye.
Okay, so what I've done is I've made an overgrown garden, I put a fence going around, I made it look as factory like as possible, I made it all overgrown, and right now I'm basically going to put a um, sign up that obviously an entrance sign. Oh, so people know where the en entrance is. And also, um, I put rocks going around the outside of the riverbank just to make it a bit more detailed. You know, you can never go too detailed in this game, so I thought it looked nice. Anyway, I need to find where the signs are for a start. Um, right, now we've got to choose one that I like. Uh, white? That I like. Uh, I want one like wooden, maybe. Or if you could change the colour of one of them. Let's see. Ah, that is way too big. That looks nice. Maybe I could change the colour. Or just get a different side. Oh, actually, that looks nice as well. I think I might stick with this one. Just change the colour. Maybe brownish. Make it look like all factory like. Mm, yeah, I like that. That looks nice. Let's place one in there. I'm placing another one in the other bit of the entrance as well. No, not on the toilets. I don't want one on the toilets. On this entrance. Okay, now I need to put uh, at words actually say entrance on them, <laughs> obviously. The entrance sign, not a whatever sign. <laughs> I think we should go for this one. Should I have the writing as well? Red? Yeah, I like that. I like that a lot. Okay, now we'll do the other side. The other one is red. Well, I'm happy that we got the courtyard done. And uh, now I'm going to do this building. <laughs> I want it as close to the other side as possible. So, yeah, I need to put that archway in the middle as well and get the same windows. back in the middle. I shall time back to you until this is done. So I'll see you in a bit. Bye bye.
now back and now it's time to extend this pathway out to obviously so we can put our first ride in. I also want sort of like a um like a hedge like thing maybe a few plants sort of in the middle as well so you know you want the entrance to look as nice as possible so I'm gonna have sort of like a maybe some cut trees or something in there um, yeah now I want to see if I can get it so it gets a bit narrower of the path um, but it doesn't look like I'd be able to do that no I can't uh, okay let's make it the same length then Okay, I plan on putting a carousel sort of in the middle of this area. I mean, a carousel is like a factory sort of ride you can possibly get. For, a, for an entrance ride, you don't want to have something too thrilling for an entrance ride. Let's just fill it all in for now and work out where the carousel will go in a bit. Again, I shall time lapse you until I've got the like the trees and stuff and the decorations done, and I'll be back. Okay, so now we're going to put the carousel in, and yeah, I do not know what size we're going to do it. Um, I think they're quite big, but not massive. Um, see, okay, I'm going to get rid of this, and I'm going to make the path a bit wider because I don't like the singular paths um, for a main street entrance sort of thing. Yes, yeah, so I'm gonna put the, the double path down. Like that. And there we go, like that. Now let's put the carousel down. There it is. Okay. Um, we need a viewing area so that people can view it there or the other side. Uh, I'm gonna go to the other side, I want the entrance on this side. Okay, like that. Put the entrance in and the exit. The exit has the path, which is a bit confusing. Because uh, obviously it's all going to automatically connect to where a path is. Uh, let's get it like that as close as possible. Like that. There we go. And now let's add the colour schemes. Actually, let's do colours. Um, I don't know what colour to do. Um, I'm not good at doing these sort of colours, so. If anyone wants to um, comment any colours I should do for this, please do comment and I'll pick what colour I want from your comments. You just got to look all old and abandoned, that's all I'm going to say. There we go, that'll just do for now. I can probably change it in another time or if you leave comments, I'll pick the uh, one that I like the most probably won't get many comments anyway but if you do that would be useful but if you don't then um, I'm not expecting tons of comments I don't normally get many comments
Okay, I'm going to do the scenery and um, I'll be back. Okay, we are back, I've done the theming, as you can see I've got 100% for the theming and um, yeah, I'm going to test this I think because uh, the excitement rating isn't very good, so maybe if I test it a few times the excitement rating might go up, I hope, so let's put this on test in a bit, okay, I'm going to speed it up a bit and now put it on test, there we go. Let's see what this excitement rating is going to be. Probably not that high, it's only in carousel to be honest. As you can see, I, for the theming I wanted to go for a uh, abandoned sort of factory area. Again, like I said earlier on, I think I said it so many times. I wanted it all to be sort of fallen down, like, as you can see the chimneys are sticking out. It's all like in a, a, um, one of those volcano villages. Anyway, the test results are very good. The excitement is very poor, but I think as this area gets better, uh, the excitement rating should go up for the ride. Um, so yes, that will do it for this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to comment your colours for the for the uh, carousel, obviously, and I'll see you next video. Bye bye.